So in terms of the next trends, I think um, AI is kind of already gone into every field possible. So every industry is adopting it. But there's need for standardization and democratization of AI. So for democratizing AI, there needs to be simplified platforms. So I think the more simple AI becomes, the more companies will adopt it. So for me, I think the next biggest trend which is going to happen is to simplify AI platforms. And that includes right from data prep all the way through productionalizing an AI model. And there are platforms already in this space, but they do one or the other. And we need something which is really simple so a citizen's data scientist can do it. You don't need to have PhDs to do it, but anybody who has knowledge of like business analytics or engineering can become a data scientist with that. Do you think we are at the peak of companies and the next AI coming? Mm. I think we are actually not even in, at 20 to 30 percent of penetration. I feel like we have a lot, lot more to do in terms of the uh, AI winters. We have a lot of investments flowing, especially from Chinese organizations where they're talking about visual recognition or deep learning in AI. In fact, Europe government or the European Commission has promised to increase its investment to like 1.5 billion by 2020 because they want to stay competitive. They want private and public companies to give at least 20 billion in AI uh, related industries because they want to stay competitive and prevent brain drain here. I think we're not in the winter. We have to do more so that it becomes part of the process. So for example, right, if you say AI winter is going to come, you won't have Alexa or a Siri on your phone because that's the basic component of voice-based AI. There, there's just going to be so common that it will become part of your everyday life. What do you think of big data Spain? Oh, big data Spain, I'm just blown away by the scale of things and the operations. So for me to come here, I was working with the organizers and they had about 50 email exchanges for every single speaker, very well executed. Um, I would just say that you guys are an integral part to making more AI prevalent in Europe. I feel like you need to do more of this so more people become aware and you get parity with like the Asian and um, United States in terms of uh, AI development. So kudos to your team. <laughs> thank you so much. Oh, thank you.